Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And while it is most common in women, some people don't realize men can get it too. And WENY's Lindsay Madison spoke with the medical director of radiology at Arnett Health about the importance of getting screened and also newly expanded insurance coverage for breast cancer screenings and imaging in New York State. For men, about 1% get diagnosed with breast cancer. For women, it's about 1 in 8 and the second leading cause of cancer deaths in women. And so that's why with women we do routine screening yearly, usually a baseline mammogram around the age of 35 and then from the age of 40 and onward, we usually recommend once a year screening with mammography. The most common way breast cancer is found is the discovery of a lump. But Acosta says some of the advanced signs you may have breast cancer include puckering or dimpling in the skin, or the skin thickens. So a hardened area that usually feels uh, kind of round or like a marble in an area of the breast, uh, that would be uh, a not uncommon presentation for a new law. To help with access to breast cancer screening and imaging, today, New York Governor Kathy Hochul signed legislation to expand insurance coverage of breast cancer screenings and imaging. Governor Hochul says women should have access to the full scope of coverage options, which is key to early diagnosis and treatment. Acosta agrees that early detection can save lives. He says sometimes there are limitations on what insurance covers, and it can be an inconvenience and stressful to deal with. For instance, if we uh, get a patient and they have maybe lesions in both breasts, it happens sometimes. Uh, insurance may limit you that you're only allowed to do one of those breasts on that particular day. So essentially, you'd have to do that, bring them back on another day to do the other to be able to get that covered from insurance. You know, that extra anxiety is not something we want to have happen for the patient. Lindsay Madison, WENY News.